All right, welcome back, everybody. Next episode of Hogwarts Legacy. Last episode was was a different one. Uh, we did a main quest, which we were inside of a book, and it got crazy. So if you missed on that one, I recommend you go back and watch it. Uh, it was not only very important for the story, but it was also very different from the rest of the game so far. So uh, we did that, and then we are back. We're going to do this Grief and Vengeance, so we're going to speak with Natty, and then after that, if we have time, we'll go speak with Deke uh, about this Phoenix, uh, which should be pretty cool. After that, unless other quests come up, I think, because uh, in the Shadow of the Mountain and in this one, uh, these are both very far south in areas that we have not uh, made it to yet. So we will be traveling very soon here in the Reveille. southernmost area. Is there a chest below me? Ah, I, I have been meaning it. to speak with you. All right, let's see what this I one's about. I still can't believe we escaped the Ashwinders. You may not realize it, but you are the talk of the school since you saved me that day. I wonder how everyone knows about it. I told my mother in the hope that she would be more forgiving of what I have been up to if it came from me. She likely told other professors, and <laughs> news travels quickly. Unfortunately, she might, in fact, have been even less forgiving than I'd hoped. I mean, her concern is fair, but she should also be proud at the same time. But there's no middle option here. <laughs> Fuck. Um... We'll just, I don't blame we'll her for being concerned. We have been involved in some dangerous activities. As the Ashwinders were locking me up and threatening my life, it did occur to me that my mother may have been right. <laughs> has Officer Singer done anything with the evidence we provided? She has not. Harlow is as strong as ever. She's in on Someone it. needs to stop him, whether it is us or Officer Singer. If someone had stopped the monsters like him in Matabililand, my father would be what? alive today. What exactly happened to your father? It was a beautiful day. My mother had gone to tend to a neighbor who was ill, and so my father and I were galloping in the savannah. Galloping? Your father was also an animagus, I take it. He could become the most majestic giraffe, and he would carry me on his back, my arms around his neck. We were on our way home when we surprised a group of bandits. Who had come from our village one of them saw me just as he removed a scarf from his face he shouted and then aimed his rifle he didn't want you to identify him exactly in an instant my father bowed his neck to protect me and was hit as he fell my father changed back into his human form when the bandits saw this they turned and ran in fear magic terrified them and then he was gone and it was all my fault. Your fault? How so? He died protecting me. If I had been capable of protecting myself, he would still be alive today. My mother and I like tried to go on situation. without him, but it became too much for us there. A few years later, we left to come to Scotland. Do you think taking down the Ashwinders will avenge your father's death? No. Vengeance is not what drives me. My father would not want that. He, and my mother, raised me to believe that it is a privilege to be able to fight for those who cannot. I know there is risk involved, but I feel it is worth it. <laughs> I am glad you seem to think so, too. What does your mother think about all of this? Well, as you saw, she worries a great deal. She is an excellent seer. But I think it bothers her to this day that she did not see my father's death coming. She misses him. As do I. So I believe on some level she understands my need to seek justice in a small way. But that does not mean that she likes it. Do you think your father would approve of the things we've been doing? Oh my. That is a good question. In theory, yes. Although he would worry as my mother does. But I think he, of all people, would understand my persistence. My father never shied away from a fight for good, no matter how ruthless the foe. And I think he would have enjoyed knowing that I had a compatriot like you. Ooh. I'm sorry, Natty. I can't imagine what you've been through. 
Your father sounds exceptional. He was. Truly extraordinary. And thank you for your kind words. We all have our burdens. My father had a saying about that. Yes, I remember. Rain does not fall on one roof alone. Exactly. Soon you and I will put an end to the Ashwinders, beginning with Harlow. And once he is gone, we will turn our attention to Rookwood. We are making progress, and we will succeed. Thank you again for saving me. You deserve of course, of all course. of the praise you have received. Of course, I am pretty awesome. I deserve all of the praise. Yes. He has a brand new game. Just beware the open flame. <coughs> Is he gonna drop him? Is he gonna drop him? Is he gonna drop him? Make him drop him? <laughs> Not bad, actually. He, he did pretty good. Not gonna lie. Okay. That relic is the key to saving Anne. I know it. Meet me outside of Feldcroft as soon as you can. Okay. Well, it sounds like that's kind of where we're going right now. Or do we do the Deke mission? That's the question. Let's do the Deke mission. Let's just get this one over with. Um, do, 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 do. And if, again, if you haven't been watching too much, I'm not too big on doing the, the beasts portion of the game, uh, but I will do Deke the Deke has some exciting news to share. Hello, Deke. But nothing too Professor much Professor Weasley that. said you had an idea. Indeed, Deke does. Uh, Deke knows that you want to learn about all sorts of beasts. And Deke yeah. recently heard rumors of a phoenix nest in a nearby mountain. A phoenix nest? I wonder if it belongs to the phoenix Natty mentioned, the one Harlow and the poacher pack are after. Deke would not doubt it. If Deke has heard of it, surely the nasty poachers have as well, which means it could be in danger. Well, I'd better go and rescue it then, hadn't I? And Deke thinks so. So majestic a beast should not fall into such vile hands. Deke is not sure why, but Deke feels that saving a phoenix might help to make amends for what happened with Deke's prior master. Deke hopes that you are able to find the phoenix and bring it to the room where it will be safe. Okay. So, where is this cave? Up in the mountains, or is it that? down here in the mountains. This main story? Oh, it's it's down here. Okay, so we will go and talk to Sebastian over here and see what's going on, but it, other than that, it looks like we're gonna be taking this route into this southern area. Go through the coastal cavern, Poidseer po Coast, into Maranwim. A bunch. We are somewhat nearing the end of the game, it feels like. I don't know how many episodes we'll have left, but I think we're about maybe three-fourths, if not more than that. Kind of exciting. Then we, uh, then we start moving on to other games before Assassin's Creed Shadows comes out. Sebastian. We'll talk about that later. A lost relic from a catacomb which requires a dark sacrifice. I know how it sounds, but if this can help you, it's worth the risk. Does Ominous know about this? He helped find the scriptorium where we discovered Slytherin's spellbook. <sighs> Very well. If Ominous will be there, I'll what meet you. a way you. of answering that question. We don't have much time. Solomon wants to leave Feldcroft. What? Leave? Never mind. You need to stall him. Buy us time, Anne. Please. I shall do my best. I'll be in touch. Solomon can't take Anne from Feldcroft. Where would they go? When would I see her? Sebastian, I can't believe my uncle wants to leave Feldcroft. Anne's going to stall him. She must. We need time. Time? For what? I've learned more about the relic. I cross-reference Slytherin's spellbook with everything in the library on relics and dark sacrifices. That's when I realized something. I believe the relic will only work inside the catacomb. 
So we have to get Anne to the catacomb and then conduct a sacrifice. Seems risky. It'll be worth the risk. Our biggest hurdle may be convincing Ominous. Anne will only give this a chance if he's on board. And we have to keep all of this from your uncle. If he goes to the headmaster, well, he could be expelled. Let me handle Ominous this time. As for my uncle, he's not an aura anymore. What he doesn't know, well, won't hurt us. Do you think your uncle would tell anyone at the Ministry about all of this if he found out? If he found out, I doubt he'd go to the Ministry. He didn't part ways with them well, from what I understand. He won't say, but I believe his strong aversion to dark magic has something to do with his time there. Anne thinks he once decided to fight fire with fire, so to speak, and resorted to using an unforgivable curse and fight against dark wizards. At least that's what she thought she heard. When he realized what his job had led him to become, he left rather abruptly. So, I'm not sure he'd go to the Ministry to report on his own family using dark magic now. Good luck with Ominous. Until we meet again. I shall let you know when the four of us should meet at the catacomb. Look for my owl. See you soon. Walk away a little bit and see if that just procs for some reason. I don't think it will. It's too soon. So... Let's do some traveling, huh? It's been a while. We haven't had to go past like this little area in a long time. So, um, yeah, we'll probably just hit these three. Actually, we we'll go boom, 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 and then here, and then we will track that quest. So, can we? Can't just go there from here. Ah, we'll see. Whatever. We'll figure it out. But, um, yeah, so what I was mentioning before is we will finish uh, Hogwarts Legacy on the channel. After that, uh, I think I've made a decision. So we'll have roughly two months worth of videos before Assassin's Creed Shadows comes out. And the big thing with that is I don't want to start Origins um, right before we have to go and play shadows it, in the sense of we won't finish origins at all um by the time shadows comes out and so i don't want to like cut it in half i want to play it and just kind of rock it from there is can i it not get over oh we have to go up oh it is okay all right wait you can't go that way what Mass confusion. Where am I supposed to go, man. Huh? Wait. Wait, wait. I can't do not where. Okay, so where is this taking? Oh, we have to go around that way. Oh, weird. Okay. Sure. Uh, whatever. We'll follow. Um. I think we have to do this yet. We're kind of gonna skip over a lot of this type of stuff and just ignore it for now. Wait, we have to like go through. I wonder if we have to go through. Which means we might as well. Probably don't even have to fight. Ah. We just have to steal. Yes. Like, this is dumb. Okay. So, back to what I was saying, though. Um, we will... The decision I made is we need about 60 videos worth. And so, we need a somewhat shorter game. And what I decided was uh, a game that I've been wanting to play and... Uh, for the channel was uh, Uncharted. Uh, the only ones that are on PC well, without using an emulator, of course, me, is all day. Mind you. Uh, Uncharted 4 Could and um, what's the other? Uh, Lost Legacy. So those are the only two, and those have put together 
is actually like the perfect amount of time that it should really take. Okay, we're just gonna deal with this because I can't talk and do that at the same time, apparently. Oh, I'm dead. Maybe not. Good. Bombarda. What well, blame Okay, cool. Uh, right there. Right. Cool, cool. So, uh, we will be playing Uncharted 4 after this game, and then we will do Uncharted uh, Lost Legacy. This looks and insane. that should get us to where we uh, can play Shadows, and then we can work with that. Is this... Did I even become really, really sure? Because Oh, I have to keep going through. Okay, well that makes more sense. Got it. You can't imagine Okay, so again, yes, we'll be playing Uncharted 4 and then Uncharted Lost Legacy, and that should bring us to November 12th when uh, Shadows comes out. So then we'll play Shadows, and uh, after that, we will continue and play. Uh, after that, we're starting Assassin's Creed from the beginning. So it'll be Assassin's Creed 1 and then 2 Brotherhood, Relations 3 and 4, and then we will have to figure out other games. Which is going to a breakthrough. I can feel it. I didn't get close to that, so that sucks. Ow. Ow! Is that the best you can do? Oh, relax. For one, I don't know where your little boy is. There you are. This is so much Ogbert the Art. Revelio. Branrock has fooled you all to your demise. So, yeah, I'm excited to be done with this game though and play Uncharted again. That's if those games come to uh, PC, all all of them come to PC, then we'll play them all. 100%. I, those games are fantastic. Run, buddy? I absolutely love those games. So... Let's go. Get other things for now. But hitting the balloons is priority. Because yes. They might have to come back up for that. So close. We were right next to it. Oh, well, we'll get it eventually. We gotta hit the balloons. Beautiful. Okay. Um, so now we're closer to this one, so we're just gonna avoid the other one. It's gonna drive me insane, so I'll have to go get it later. But we'll do that later. Ooh. Quest. Betting on the dragon fights was the best decision. Anyone looking for trouble? Hmm. One of a little bastard. Protector! I kinda wanna change back to Confringo. If that makes sense. Nah, that was the wrong one. Bam. 
I love when they have so much stuff to throw around. It's my favorite. Wait, you get me? Oh, shoot. Oh, I think that guy knocked me out and I wasn't supposed to. Double blame me on that guy. Dirtbag. Yeah, we'll just end you. I'm, a, I'm over and in. Hi. There we go. Should be all, but I guess maybe. Rebellion. That. Oh, that guy's fighting spiders down there. Okay, fine. I don't want that chest anyway. What is this? Oh, it's a map. Okay. Huh. Well. The location marked on the map isn't far from here. It's it's. How would you know that? First of all, the chest is inside. Perhaps there. not the best place to be caught alone. You didn't. How does one get inside? Is there a door over here? Ah. Where's that goblin helm, you little thief? Depulsor, bombarder, defender, Who am I fighting right now? Is this on the outside of the wall? One and back. Gosh, that would that'd be insane. That's a thousand eight. That's crazy. Uh, we're going to go on the outside, because I think this is on the outside. Of course it is. Wait. There's like a, a hard enemy in there. Wait. Where are you at? Hello, Iona. That was fun. What gave you? Bombarda. Glacius. Depulsa. Do you guys just like respawn here or what? Am I crazy? Knock it off, please. Bombarda. Hi. Nice to meet you. Oh, you're a nice commissioner. You're gonna die. Oh, I didn't really do much. Let me out of So lucky I was just spamming that button. Okay, guys. I've you guys haven't had enough of this. Yeah, I think the Franco might be more fun. Did I? Ah, oh, she's on like the other side of this thing now? Well, I might be over it. So, whatever. Do to do to do. Going. Go around, or can we actually just skip over? Let's find out. Going here. It wants us to go around a big thing. looks like we can just go over which is gonna be great so let's go find oh
Of course. Oh. Hello, friendos. Oh, there's even a fast travel here. Sick. Um, just for fun. Let's go raid this camp. And then we'll probably end the episode. Fighting so a troll right now? Uh, hi, guys. Ooh, I didn't see that one. You got me, buddy. Does this look like it's luck? Camo. Cool. Revelio. Look around. Let's take this. So we'll probably end the episode here, and the next episode we will continue and we'll go and find what is all this stuff? There's so much stuff. That's Yeah, they're not gonna survive it. So we'll just avoid that because we don't need to do that. Uh, and we will go find a phoenix, hopefully. I'm, I'm assuming they'll have us find a phoenix. I don't think they're going to tease us like that and not have it happen. So we will do that uh, next episode. So thank you guys so much for watching. Greatly appreciate it. I hope you have a good rest of your day, night, whatever it is. And I will see you in the next one. Peace.